It's time to get your day started off right with the Hip Hollywood Daily Hype. OnlyFans has a message for Beyonce. After B hopped on the remix for the Meg Thee Stallion hit single Savage and shouted out the adult entertainment site, they responded, of course. Hips tick tock when I dance. dance. On that demon time, she might start her OnlyFans. In a statement provided to Rolling Stone, a representative for the service said, Beyonce and any artist are welcome to join OnlyFans at any time to foster a deeper connection with their fans. Believe it or not, the subscription-based photo and video service has seen a huge increase in membership during this time. Meanwhile, folks are still loving TikTok, and no surprise here, have already created a dance for the Savage Remix. I'm a boss, I'm a leader, I pull up in my two-seater, and my mama was a savage, nigga got this shit from Tina. In other music news, there's a KKK beef, and we ain't talking about the clan. Music stars and Bay Area natives Kamaya and Keisha Cole are putting fellow singer Kalani on blast, and it's all over a song. In case you missed it, Kamaya did an IG Live and began shading a certain singer. While she didn't name names, it became clear that she was talking about Kalani. I answered no questions. That know what it is, it's up. It's been up for a while now. Y'all keep asking me questions. I don't f with her at all. Interestingly, the ladies used to be very close, like have matching tattoos close. So it was very odd to hear that they weren't speaking. Shortly after, Kamaya did a second stream and revealed it came down to issues with Kalani's song, All Me, which originally featured all three of the artists together. Kalani took the social media to give her side and also addressed claims she called Kamaya black and ghetto, saying she would never say something so harmful. Meanwhile, Keisha Cole appeared on Quarantine Chronicles on Hollywood Unlocked and discussed her beef with Kalani. Do you see a friendship in the future? Do you want a friendship in the future? You know, anything's possible as far as like, um being cool again but i don't i don't think i just don't think friendship apparently cole was also upset she didn't appear in the video for all me kalani of course pulled out the receipts to prove it was cole's fault not the other way around Woo -chow. can y'all just get along and finally stacy dash has announced that she and husband jeff marty are getting a divorce Marty is husband number four for the Clueless star. Dash made the announcement on her Instagram Thursday afternoon saying, my husband and I have made the hard decision of ending our marriage. After much prayer, I feel this is the right decision for both of us. I wish him nothing but the best. Per their reps, the split is amicable. This news is not surprising, however. If you recall in September, Dash was arrested for assaulting Marty during a physical altercation at their Florida home. Dash claimed it was self-defense and charges were dropped in October. All right, guys, that's our daily hype. You be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on Facebook and Twitter. For HipHollywood.com, I'm Jasmine Simpkins.